Hi everyone, and welcome to my channel. Today, we're going to be talking about the new agreement between Gulf countries to issue a common visa. The agreement was signed by the six Gulf Cooperation Council, GCC countries, Bahrain, Kuwait, Oman, Qatar, Saudi Arabia, and the United Arab Emirates. It states that visitors who obtain a visa for one of these countries will be able to travel to all six countries without having to apply for a separate visa for each one. The common visa system is expected to have several benefits, including reduced costs, convenience, increased tourism and economic growth. Visitors will only need to pay for a single visa, which can save them money on visa application fees. They will also only need to apply for a single visa, which can save them time and hassle. The common visa system is expected to attract more tourists to the Gulf region, as it will make it easier and more convenient for them to travel to all six countries. Additionally, it is expected to boost economic growth in the Gulf region by increasing tourism and trade. The procedure for applying for a common Gulf visa is still being finalized, but it is expected to be similar to the process for applying for a visa for any of the individual GCC countries. Visitors will likely need to submit an online application and provide documentation such as a passport, passport photo, and proof of travel insurance. The fees for a common Gulf visa are also still being finalized, but they are expected to be similar to the fees for a visa for any of the individual GCC countries. The common Gulf visa is expected to be implemented in the near future. Once it is implemented, visitors will be able to apply for a common Gulf visa through the embassy or consulate of any of the six GCC countries. In conclusion, the new agreement between Gulf countries to issue a common visa is a positive development for both visitors and the Gulf countries themselves. The common visa system is expected to make it easier and more convenient for visitors to travel to the Gulf region, and it is also expected to boost economic growth in the region. Thank you for watching. I hope this video was informative. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below.